Hey what's up everybody, my name is Evax7 and welcome back to more Kingdom Hearts Final Mix. In the previous episode we completed the Field Cup back in the Olympus Coliseum and today we're gonna set journey to another world, that's right guys, so we're gonna travel through this whirlpool and here we go. Alright so now that we have a warp gummy block installed in our gummy ship not only we can fast travel to worlds we've already visited, but we can actually travel through warp holes. <laughs> and yeah, that's exactly what we're gonna do in this video. Because to reach this new world, we really need to go through this warp hole thing, as you guys are gonna see. Anyway, if you already read the title, you... <laughs> well, you already figured that today we're gonna be visiting Hagrabat. That's right, the world based on the Latin movie. And oh man. Here we go, yeah this is the warp hole, yeah let's do this, here we go. Alright, and uh, as I was saying, um, uh, it, this world is based on the Aladdin movie and I just love uh, Aladdin. Uh, between Lion King and Aladdin, I don't really know which one is my favorite Disney movie. I know a lot of people really like Lion King and all that stuff. And I can understand it because it's tragic, it's, uh, well, it's funny at the same time. You know, the story itself is amazing, amazingly well done. But I don't know, I, I really like Aladdin for some reason. And I figure it might be my favorite Disney movie of all time. Anyway, <laughs> yeah, so... The world itself um, has some aspects related to the movie, but, well, it's kind of a different approach, you guys are gonna see what I mean. But personally, I guess they, they did a really good job uh, to uh, at least give this feeling of Agrabah, you know, bring up this feeling into a video game, I guess they really managed to do it. Anyway, I don't know if this is gonna take... S oh. Yeah! Can you guys hear it? That's right! <laughs> the music just changed. Uh, if I recall, there are actually three versions of the Gummy Ship music. Uh, this is the second one. The first one is very slow paced, this one is kinda of faster. And <laughs> the third one is even more dramatic, if you can call it like that. Anyway, this is it! Here we go! This is Agora, finally reached a new world. So yeah, we're gonna disembark. Hope you guys are ready. And the keyhole? The Heartless are searching for it now. I'm certain we'll find it soon enough. So that just leaves... <laughs> Jafar! I've looked everywhere for Jasmine! She's disappeared like magic! <laughs> the girl is more trouble than she's worth. You said you had things under control. Agrabah is full of holes for rats to hide in. But why worry about Princess Jasmine? With her or without her, surely this world will be ours when we find the keyhole. We need all seven princesses of heart to open the final door. Any fewer is useless. Well, if the princess is that important, we'll find her. Find Jasmine and bring her to me at once. Don't steep yourself in darkness too long. The heartless consume the cares. <laughs> Your concern is touching, but hardly necessary. Mm -hmm. 
Alright, here we are, and that's right, we're gonna have to fight against some more Artless. <laughs> hey, what did you expect? I mean, this is Kingdom Hearts. You are supposed to fight against Artless, right? <laughs> anyway, uh, as you guys just saw, Jafar and Maleficent are up to no good, and they want to capture Jasmine. And of course, we can't let that happen, right? Of course we can't. Alright, so, we're just gonna take care of these Artless and see if we can help somehow. Right, just got a mega potion. Oh, wait a second. Oh, right, I remember now. Uh, there was a save point right here, if I recall. And there's also a Trinity Mark. Yeah, see? Save points right here. Um, I don't think I can grab anything else by now, since I don't have the Trinity. Um, yeah, so I'm just gonna proceed. Let me see, I think, yeah, see right there, treasure chest. Uh, the thing about this very first section of Agrabah is that um, there are several streets and this kind of acts as a labyrinth. Not really, you know, but you have to activate several switches uh, to unlock several gates. So, I'm gonna see if I can do that so we can proceed throughout the world. Come on. But yeah, this is actually the very first section of uh, the world itself, because uh, the second section, well, <laughs> it does remind me the movie a lot. And when I mean a lot, I mean like a lot. Uh, it's actually, well, the Cave of Wonders. And of course, the Cave of Wonders, it's just amazing. I, I just love the, the part uh, in the movie where Aladdin grabs the the lamp and everything emits the carpet the genie i think it's so amazing and even though they they it's they didn't really manage to recreate the whole thing they did give it the best feeling they could and when i'm visiting the cave of wonders in kingdom hearts i really feel that it's part of the the movie itself i really feel connected to to that place i think they they really did a good job Anyway, uh, I think we could, yeah. Alright, so I'm just gonna defeat this Artless right here. Alright, and I think we can go up here. Yeah, right. We go, and let's go through here. Alright, so... Oh, wait. Oh, there we go. The carpet. <laughs> Alright, so... Basically, <laughs> what Donald is trying to tell us is that we need to go to the desert. But before we, we do that, let's just explore the city a bit more, right? And that's what we're gonna do. So, uh, before I actually go right ahead to the desert, um, I'm gonna see if I can grab myself some more treasure sets and if I can also uh, activate all these switches I was talking about. See this gate right here? There's a way to unlock it. Uh, and there are several other gates throughout the, the world as you guys are gonna see and we will have to unlock all of them so we can proceed in the story. Anyway, so... I'm just getting back to the main street. I'm pretty sure I missed something back in this building. Yeah, I guess it was actually one of these switches I was talking about. Let me just... Oh, wait. Oh, yeah, the... <laughs> this is the merchant. <laughs> just as the movie. <laughs> oh, man. So great. Alright. Um... I'd really like if I could grab that treasure chest, but I, these artless are getting in the way. Wait a sec. Oh man, come on, dude. Really? No! Oh, uh, no, I'm not going down there once again. Oh crap. Really? Oh, thank god, the guy actually died. Alright. I managed to open the chest. <laughs> Oh, I thought I had to go down there once again and I would have messed the whole thing. Yeah, forget it. <laughs> Good thing the guy actually died right there. Anyway, so... Oh, see. 
Yeah, I I knew there was a, a switch right here. Okay, so now that we've unlocked this gate, let's see if we can keep moving. I hope this is the gate I've unlocked. Yes, it is. All right. Some more artless. Can I get to that chest? Yes! Awesome. Okay. Where's that other pot? I don't know. I guess it just ran away. Okay, so that's another closed gate. Hmm. Alright, so for now I guess the only way is this one right here. Okay, let's go through the alley. See what happens. Who's there? Hello. And we found Jasmine. Awesome. Mm-hmm. I think Jafar is gonna appear soon actually. Uh, yeah, I guess there's gonna be a cutscene right here. A letter. Where might I find this street rat? Jasmine, allow me to find you more suitable company, my dear princess. These little rats won't do you see. Jasmine, run! Ah, the boy who holds the key. Alright, so now we managed to find Jasmine, but still, Aladdin is nowhere to be found. And yeah, we're gonna have to see if we can actually find him somewhere around Agrabah. Because Jasmine seemed worried about him, so yeah. Let's see if we find him somewhere here. But before we do that, let me just defeat some more Artless. Come on, and let's release this other lock. Alright, just open another gate. And to be honest, I think we can't unlock any other gate for now. Yeah, I guess we really need to find Aladdin before we can actually proceed and be able to unlock another of these gates. Yeah, I think that's it. So, I'm just going back to the main street and from there on I guess we're just gonna get back to the to the very entrance of Agrabah and see if we can actually reach the desert or something. Yeah. Alright, so this is the only way for now. We really need to do it. Okay, so just gonna heal myself really quickly. Come on, Sora. We go. Right, and let's follow the magic carpet then. Let's head to the desert. I just love the way they managed to design the Maji carpet. Just the way it looked in the movie. It's so awesome. Anyway, yes, we're gonna come along. Alright! We just found Aladdin, but yeah, the guy's in danger, we have to save him, come on! Let's defeat this Artless as fast as possible. Come on guys, stop defending. Right, so right, come on, come on! Did I get all... oh no, there's still one up there. Okay, we got this. Good 
Scores, not again! Genie, get rid of these guys! <laughs> Wish number one coming right up! I see. <laughs> Thanks, Sora. Aladdin, what are you doing out here? Same old stuff. Hunting legendary treasure. Just paid a visit to the Cave of Wonders. I found that magic carpet. And this lamp. Legend has it that whoever holds the lamp can summon Please, with... kid, leave the intros to a professional. The one and only Genie of the Lamp! Rub it up, dub the lamp, and have your dearest wishes granted. Today's winner is Aladdin! Congratulations! Aladdin Rush! Patience, my fine feathered friend. Any three wishes. A one wish, a two wish, a three wish. Then I make like a banana and split it. Our lucky winner made his first wish. And let me tell you what a doozy that wish was. So he has two left. So, master, what do you have for wish number two? <laughs> How about making me a fabulously wealthy prince? Whoa! Money, royalty, fame! Why didn't I do that? Okay, you asked for it. A hundred servants and a hundred camels loaded with gold. Just say the word and I'll deliver it in 30 minutes or less or your meal free! Hey, I'll even throw in a cappuccino. <laughs> no thanks. Okay. I think I'll put that on hold until we reach Agrabah. Oh, why a prince? You see... There's this girl in Agrabah named Jasmine, but she's a princess, and I'm... Ah, uh, she could never fall for a guy like me. Oh, princess? Jasmine? Oh, that's right. She's in trouble, Aladdin. What? Well, come on, let's get going. All right, so... Yes, I want Aladdin in my party, so... Sorry, Goofy. <laughs> oh, man. Ah, fresh air, the great outdoors. I guess you don't get out much, huh? Comes with a job. Phenomenal cosmic powers. Itty bitty living space. It's always three wishes, then back to my portable prison. I'm lucky to see the light of day every century or two. Say, Genie, what if I use my last wish to free you from the lamp? What do you think? You do that? Genie, it's a promise. After we help Jasmine. <laughs> Okay, and we're back in the city, and as you can see, Aladdin is in my team now, and oh man, this is awesome. This is one of the things I like about Kingdom Hearts, even though uh, I really like uh, to play uh, with Donald and Goofy, you can actually, um, the game itself actually gives you the chance to also party with other members of Disney movies, of the Disney worlds, you know? And uh, it's really awesome, that's one of the things I, I really like about uh, the, um, the series. Uh, it, it's, it's just so great. Anyway. Alright, so, now that we're back in the city, uh, there are some paths that have some barriers now, as you can see right here. There are some barricades. Uh, while others just open, such as this one, remember? This one was closed and now it's open, so yeah. So, if I recall, um, I think we can now get access to a place called the Bazaar. Yeah, I think that was it. And the next, uh, the next switch should be there and once I unlock it, uh, I'll be able to reach um, the, um, 
the place we need to get to in the city. So yeah, alright, let's just kill all these guys. Oh, awesome! Another level for Sora. Alright, come on. There we go. Alright, so... Is there any ability I can... Tech boost, maybe? Mm, yeah, I'm just gonna equip tech boost. Alright. Gives me some extra experience every time I parry an enemy's attack, so that's good. Alright, um... Okay. So where was this bazaar already? Uh, let me think, let me think... Um, no, I don't think it was this way. Oh yeah, I, I think I got it. I know where it is. Alright, let me just kill this guy. No, don't fall. Oh man, that was close. Okay, the bazaar is right here, see? And the next switch should be in this very room. Alright, so... Just need to defeat some more artlets and we should be good to go. Right. Yeah, let's kill this bandit. Yeah, I, I, if I recall, these guys are... I don't really remember their names. Maybe they are... Were they spider pots? Yeah, I think that's their name. Spider pots. And these guys are bandits. Alright. Okay, come on. No, no. Alright. Okay, there's a blue trinity mark in this room, but since I don't have Goofy in the party at the moment, I can't do anything about it. Instead of that, we're just gonna collect as many chests as we can, and we're gonna activate the other switch. Okay, so, come on. There we go, and the switch is right here, as you guys can see, so let's do this. Can I actually equip one of these accessories? Let me see the fire ring, maybe? No. It doesn't look very effective for what I have in hand right now, so we're just gonna leave it like that. Okay, uh, I need to get back up there so I can <laughs> get to the other room. Right, so let's do this, come on! No, 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 oh, wow! I didn't remember they uh, they could do that. Well, that attack is really powerful. We gotta be careful about it. Come on, dude! Die already! Awesome. All right, so yeah, as I suspect, this is Aladdin's house. All right, um, so. Yes, Jafar is after the key all, just like Maleficent asked him. And yeah, we really need to stop Jafar. So I'm just gonna say really quickly, because once I get <laughs> through this other gate, there's actually gonna be a mid boss. That's right, there's gonna be a mini boss fight. So, hope you guys are ready for this. I'm just preparing myself. Come on, and I guess we're good. All right, so that's it. Was this the right way? Oh no! Oh man! Really? Okay, <laughs> wrong way. <laughs> Gotta get up there once again. You know what? Just forget about those artless. We're just gonna proceed instead. There we go. Okay, and there should be a cutscene right here, if I recall, so... Yeah, Jafar and Jasmine right there. Let's do this, guys! Setting your sights a little high, aren't you, boy? Back to your hole, street rat. I will not allow you to trouble the princess anymore. <gasps> Jasmine! I'm so sorry. Aladdin. Genie! Oh, Jasmine, please! 
One wish left. You're making this really easy, you know. <laughs> so sorry, boy. I'm afraid your second wish has been denied. Huh? I'm sorry, Al. <laughs> and now, I bid you all farewell. Attack! <laughs> Alright, and we're gonna have to fight against this Centipad Artless. That's right. <laughs> oh man, um, how did we deal damage to this guy already? Let me think. Oh yeah, I got it. So you actually need to eat... Um, to eat his head or his tail. Yeah, I guess that's it. So, these pots are just in the way, to be honest. <laughs> you just need to try to eat his head and his tail right here, see? And if you do uh, damage uh, several times, uh, you'll be able to separate both parts of his body and things get a lot easier. Go. Oh, no, 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 no. Stop it. Yeah, don't worry, Jasmine. I'm trying my best to rescue you. Alright, come on. Oh no, man. Come on. Right, so... So far, so good. You have to be careful about this attack he has. He has like this uh, dark attack with his uh, uh, <laughs> with his tail and this electric attack with his uh, head. Yeah, be careful about it. Anyway, I think we we should be almost done with this fight. See <laughs> what I was talking about? We did it. Oh man, this is so awesome. Alright, you heard the man, we need to go back to the desert. I'm just gonna take care of these guys. Come on, dude, die already. No, 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 no. Okay. And I think... <laughs> yeah, this is the hilarious part. We just defeated a boss, right? Well, guess what? <laughs> That's right. It's just gonna be another boss fight right ahead, so <laughs> I'm gonna save really quickly just in case. And well, we're gonna get back to the desert after that. So, oh man, I really need to clean this up. This is really a mess. Look at all these save files. I keep saying this, but <laughs> the thing is I just, <laughs> I just leave these save files right here and I don't bother about them. I mean, to be honest, we have like 99 save slots. And since this is a PS3, you technically have... Well, you can actually... Don't worry about these 99 slots. I mean, in a PlayStation 2, I can understand it. But in a PS3, yeah. It's not a problem a at all. Anyway. Here we go, flying the magic carpet. And... There should be a cutscene or something right here. Here we go. That's right, the next boss is none other than the <laughs> Cave of Wonders head. That's right, 
we'll have to defeat the Tiger Ed so we can get access to the Cave of Wonders. And as you can see, the eyes of the, um, of the Tiger Ed are actually glowing in a very strange color. And well, that's the power of darkness. So, to defeat this boss, you pretty much need to try to get on top of his head. See, so just as I did right here, and try to hit his eyes as much as possible. After dealing some damage, you should be able to destroy one of his eyes, and after that, just go for the other, and you should be good to go. If you want, you can just forget about this Arcless, see? And you can get on top of the Tiger Red right away. But anyway, trying to defeat these guys. Come on. Alright. Yeah, I guess I'm clean now, so. We're gonna take back. We're gonna take care of the Ed right now. Come on, come on, dude. Here we go. See if we can actually destroy one of these eyes. Right, we did it. Just need to defeat the last one and we should be good to go. No, stop moving. Alright. Okay, come on, come on, come on. To be honest, I don't think if... I, I don't know if you can actually fire um, the Cave of Wonders projectiles ba back to its eyes. I guess you can if you... Yeah, I guess you can. But you gotta be careful about it. Anyway, I guess this is the safest approach anyway, so... Just jump on top of his head and keep dealing damage to its eyes. And you shall be... Alright, we did it! Oh man, awesome. Right, anyway guys, um, now I can get access to the Cave of Wonders, but before I actually do that, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna get back to the storage right in the city, so I can heal myself up really quickly. And after that, uh, I think uh, I, I shall get inside the Cave of Wonders and start exploring the place. Right, here we go. Come on, nice. Right, so let's heal ourselves really fast. Here we go, we're good to go. Alright, so anyway guys, um to be honest, I think this is gonna be the end of this episode, and in the next video we're gonna start exploring the Cave of Wonders. So yeah, hope you enjoyed the video, if you did, don't forget to like it, you can always add it to your favorites, you can also subscribe to the channel to stay updated with all the following episodes of Kingdom Hearts Final Mix, and you can follow me on Twitter, like me on Facebook, you know, the usual stuff. Anyway, that's gonna be it, thank you all so much for watching, I'll see you next time.